Hello guys, my name is Mitsuhiro Hiroka and today I am going to show you how to install the iOS 8 beta software with a registered Apple developer account. So let's get started. Okay, so first of all, you will need to be on iOS 7.1 or 7.1.1, I think. You might have to just be on 7.1.1 or you might be able to just be on any iOS. I'm not exactly sure about that. So first of all, I am going to show you that my device is running 7.1.1. So I'm going to unlock it, go settings. I'm going to go to general, go to about and version 7.1 if you can see that right there 7.1 okay so yeah so that's what my advice is not running ios 8 it is running version 7.1 okay so now you're going to want to go to a website called after it's after it's after you made your um, developer account, and it's developer.apple.com. Okay, so you get this page. If if you signed up for the iOS app development, you should be able to click iOS apps right here, and then you'll log. In. You, you're gonna want to log into your developer account, your paid developer account. So. After you do that, you're going to want to go to iOS 8 beta. Hold on, let me just zoom in a bit. And you're going to want to scroll down until you find all this stuff down here. Okay, you'll find all the models of the iPads, iPhones, and the iPod Touch. So, I have an iPod Touch 5th generation, so I'm just going to click that. And we'll start your download. Well, I am already downloading the file. Um, I have 12 minutes left on the file, so I am going to pause the video and come back when that is up. So I will see you then. Okay, guys, I'm back here. So my iOS 8 software has been registered, but I have forgot to tell you that you need to register your UDID. So, um, to register your ID, you're just going to want to, um, let's see, you're going to want to go to this link right here after you're logged in, so I'm, I'll just paste that in the description, and you're going to put the name of your device, and then you're going to put your, the UDID. So you can find a UDID in iTunes, um, when you open up iTunes, you can go to your thing. I should say um, that, but then um, you, you click on um, that number, and then it will bring up your UDID. So, so um, okay. So now I'm gonna open up my iOS 8 beta, and here's the software right here. So I'm going to extract it to my desktop, and it's going to take a while. Not really, actually. Ah, oh, surprisingly fast. Okay, so now I have it right here. So now we're going to open up iTunes, and you're going to press Shift Update. Then you're going to go Desktop, and then find that IPSW. So, right here. Press Open. Then iTunes will update your iPod to iOS 8.0 and will verify the update with Apple. So, so let me just zoom in here so you can see that. I'm pr now I'm gonna press update. So here's my iPod. Be sure to make a backup of your of your phone or iPod or iPad um, before you before you start this process because if you don't if something may go wrong um so if you have a backup then you can restore that backup quickly so it will just be, say extracting software um i'm not going to cut the video because i'm going to show you how long it will really take so yeah still my and like for the zelda thing that looks awesome <laughs> Still extracting software. 
iTunes preparing to update software on this iPod. If you want to follow me on Instagram, that's my thing. It's LucasLink1123. So I'll put that in the description. Ooh, I got two app updates. Well, three, but I want to do them now. Actually, we um, just got an Apple developer account today, so that's pretty exciting. Um, so, I also got some, I don't know, this is just random, I also got some Zelda books right there. Um, hold on, let me just turn the camera like that. I also got some Zelda books. Okay, it's almost done extracting the software. So I'm really bored, <laughs> but I'm excited. I'm updating. It's really cool. Especially an Apple developer. I'm so happy. And um, also, if you update to this firmware, you you will lose your um if you're if you're on 7.0 7.0.6 any other software they have a jailbreak on you will lose that jailbreak so i'll put a big notice in the description it's first line you will use your jailbreak lose your jailbreak if you do this so yeah And please don't um, get the software for free. That's that's not cool. These guys work hard for their work. It's it's not cool to get the software for free. So it's all, it's almost done extracting that software. What can you even see that? Yeah, up there, extracting the software. I'm on like a big stack of books right now, so it's kind of hard. Like I'm getting a tripod, but I don't have a tripod yet. And it's almost done. And my iPod's actually still on. Um, whoop, whoa, I almost knocked down the video camera right there. So, yeah, if you want to get the iOS 8 software, just pay for a developer account. It's $99 a year. Um, so, yeah. Waiting for extractor software. Yeah. I'm just waiting for this. I, I'm actually going to pause the video because I'm really bored of just commentating randomly. So I'll be back. Now the um, iPod is... It, it says waiting for iPod. And um, after the extraction of the software, it should be waiting for the iPod. And it's just installing the software as you can see right here. Can you see that? Yeah. Yeah, it's installing the software. So... Yeah, just wait for that. <laughs> Sorry, this this is a very long this is a patience test right here. This is a patience test. If you guys like math, check out this Algebra One book. You probably already finished it. Ah uh, I also got retro Pokemon book right there. Boss. So now it says um, that it's verifying uh, the update software with Apple. Uh, yikes. Yeah, because they want to make sure that it's a real software and it's not like a hacked version of 
video on it. A jailbreak. So, still haven't started yet, but we'll just wait for it. This will take quite a while. Now it says that it's updating the software. So, um, that, that's good. Oh, see, now there's a little bar up there. And look, it's starting to go. It's pretty awesome. So I'll just hold this up, sadly. I know you guys want it. Sorry, you hear background, uh, background audio in the background. It's very loud in here. But if you don't, that's great. <laughs> the reason I'm not using my screen recorder as usual to record this um, is because I want to show off my iPod too. I probably didn't even need to show off my iPod. I mean, I'm not Oh, I just want to, sh I just want to show all my friends that I got iOS 8, and they're going to be all like, whoa, you're awesome. <laughs> Please, um, if, if this tutorial really helped you, um, you were an Apple developer previously, and you didn't know how to install iOS 8, please, comment, like, favorite, and subscribe. That, that really helps me, um, in getting... See, if you subscribe, I could earn money, and then I could, I could become more popular on YouTube. So then I can help you more. So if you help me, then I can help you more. So up there, it's almost done. Never find the software, but oh, I almost tripped on the cord again. But here, it's only about halfway, a little less. Up there, it says verifying the iPod software. Look at that Pokemon case. <laughs> it's cool. Should have taken my case off for this tutorial. <laughs> but, eh, who cares? Verifying iPod software, almost done with that. Verifying updated iPod software. I believe that you can downgrade back to um, uh, back to 7.1.1 the way I of uh, software that that Apple is still signing. Um, if you just press the little restore button. I hate this position right now. Really uncomfortable. Oh, I almost totally tipped down the camera. Tried sitting down the bench that the camera's on. It's almost done. It's moving very slowly. Updating iPod firmware, it says. I can't see that. I don't think you can see that. Yeah, you can kind of. A little. Verifying update iPod uh, firmware. IPods, verifying update iPod software. It's almost done right here. Your iPod has been updated and it's restarting. Oh, please keep your iPod connected. It will 
appear in the iTunes window after it starts. The fetch will be dismissed in one second. That's awesome. It's awesome. So let's just let it boot up. It's normal. On our iOS 8. And now it's gotta go through this again, I believe. But it's gonna be faster. Uh, I really don't wanna hold this up the whole time because my arm. Okay, so now my iOS firmware is just about done. And. So it's rebooting the device. Which is really cool. And it says iPod up there, and I just saw my um, home screen, so that's good. Um, so now it says hello. Slide to set up. Update complete. Your iPod Touch was successfully uh, was updated successfully. There are just a few things to follow, and then you're done. Continue. Um, why not? Uh, now let me just set up my passcode. Wow, well, my passcode. It's updating iCloud. Focus more. Um, you find my iPod Touch, create a passcode. Loading that. Um, set up later. Get started. And look at that! I got iOS 8. It's awesome. So, that's my tutorial on how to get iOS 8 on your iPod Touch or uh, iPod 5 or iPhone 5 or iPad. So, yeah, it's really cool. So, I will see you guys... Oh, prove I'm on iOS 8. <laughs> Do I really have to prove? <laughs> Out. 8.0 there if you can't see that right there 8.0 so I that's my video and I'll see you guys later